For the past 38 years, Good Samaritan Ministries has provided hope for the holidays. This year, Good Samaritan is looking to help with 550 families with children and 150 seniors in need. And this morning, we want to welcome Aaron Murphy to daytime to share with us more about this important giving campaign. And the key word there is giving. It really is hope for the holidays. This has been going on for 38 years now. Talk to us about hope for the holidays. Tell us, tell us, tell us all about it. Yes, sir. Um, hope for the holidays is a community effort to ensure that families in need mm -hmm. have the opportunity to share in the holiday experience. For over 38 years, right. Good Samaritan has partnered with this great and loving community and putting together Thanksgiving food boxes mm -hmm. for families as well as Christmas food boxes for families and gifts for their children. This year we have over 550 families who have been assessed and approved by our social work team and they'll be ready to pick up their boxes um, the week before Thanksgiving. Um, but we have over 200 families on our waiting list. Right. Um, so we are inviting the community to come pray along, pray with us, right. uh, advocate, uh, volunteer, and give. Uh, we have uh, some gracious donors who have answered the call to create momentum and uh, a match campaign. So right now we got about $75,000 towards our $150,000 goal. Right. and they will match everything that's given. And we're, we're seeing some video right now of the food distribution of y'all taking these hope for the holiday boxes to folks. And I've actually been out on these runs where you take the folks and I've met some of the folks that very thankful, they're very thankful, very appreciative of the help that you all are, are helping to provide. And it's, it's basically neighbor helping neighbor when you, we, when you get right down to it. Yes, sir. We believe there is a good Samaritan in the heart of each and every one of us. Sometimes you just have to tap into it. Right. Uh, but we are a, an, an organized effort uh, for the community mm -hmm. to be intentional about it. Uh, I've been blessed to work with this organization yes. for 10 years. Right. But there, there have been many that have gone on before myself that have put in the work that's totaled to 38 years. So we're looking for a successful Hope for the Holidays program this year. And part of that is the Be a Light campaign, Be a Light for Toys. Talk yeah. to us about that as well. So our Be a Light yeah. marketplace right. is one of the components of our Hope for the Holidays program. Our Be a Light uh, marketplace is, uh, is a store that we set up right. for uh, families, um, parents, grandparents to come in and shop for their children and uh, every child is a lot at so many points and it's a it's a beautiful thing to see uh, we've been doing this for quite some time and we are doing t toy drives food drives uh, we're partnering with the turkey trot this year mm -hmm. so um, we are encouraging all participants to bring in a canned good food item to go towards putting together these thanksgiving and christmas food boxes Aaron, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for everything that Good Samaritan is doing for our community. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. Thank you. Folks, it's hope for the holidays. Good Samaritan Ministries right here in Johnson City. Donate. Volunteer your time. You can do that. Call that number right there. Go to goodsamjc.org. Make a donation. Donate your time. Neighbor. Helping neighbors this holiday season.